Hey everyone, thanks a lot for watching. This is the first Griffin comic book picks for 2015. This will be for um, January 7th. The best by default. So let's see, y'all, this week we got all sorts of number ones coming out. Mostly for Marvel though. A couple of independents. And I don't see any number ones from DC on the wall. But that's mm. okay. They got a lot of fun stuff coming out later on this month. Yeah. Okay, so we're talking about a couple of fun independent books. Number one's coming out this week. We got this one, Steampunk Tales. Mm -hmm. That seems pretty interesting. I like steampunky stuff. And Ninth Generation here by Matt Hawkins, Stefan Sedjak. Uh, great team. Great creative team. They do Aphrodite 9, who is in this comic. Uh, I would highly recommend checking it out, if nothing else, for Sedjak's art. Wow. He nails it. Now, let's start talking about all the Marvel number ones we got coming out here. Whew. All right. And there's a lot. And there's a bunch. There's a bunch. And there's going to be even more this month. It's going to be a big month for Marvel. We'll talk about that a little later. Operation Sin. This is cool because it features uh, Peggy Carter. And I know she's just getting a new TV show. With Premiering Peggy. tonight. What? Yeah. Watch some Peggy Carter tonight, which when you see this will be actually yesterday night. And then buy the comic that has her in it. Today, which is tomorrow. Yeah, time's awesome. Now, this is interesting. Ant-Man, number one. And this isn't the Hank Pym Ant-Man. This is Scott uh -huh. Lang, which is an interesting move with Marvel because it's not the most well-known Ant-Man. No. Really think this is setting us up for the movie that's coming Did out. Did you know though. who he was? No, didn't think so. Read this comic and find out. Scott Lang. Marvel is following DC's little weekly trend here. DC has some really successful weekly titles. Marvel's going to try that out with Wolverines here. All new weekly series. Looks like uh, Sabretooth and X-23 and all them are going to take on the mantle of the Wolverine. Boom! Squirrel Girl number one. The unbeatable yeah. Squirrel Girl. Who I think actually is the only Marvel Universe like hero who has won every single one of her conflicts. She's beaten... Even people as big as Thanos. Yeah, there's a, there's a book where she beats Thanos. It looks like she's taking on Craven the Hunter here in this first issue. I think this is going to be a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Marvel's been doing a really good job with their female lead books and here. This looks to appeal to a wide variety of ages, oh, yeah. which is another great thing. Yeah, yeah. It's going to be a real fun book. Another number one that's very near and dear to my heart, Avengers No More Bullying. Now, I don't know about any of you guys out there, but I've been the victim of bullying throughout my life. So I think that this comic really speaks to me. You should check it out. It's got some short stories of, uh, you've got the Avengers, you've got the Guardians of the Galaxy, and you've got Spider-Man dealing with bullying because it's not just a problem on Earth. <laughs> yeah, there so, you go. Yeah, Guardians of the Galaxy. That's actually out. cool. That's cool that you're getting all those stories here for just $2. This is yeah. not an expensive book either. It's got some activities like guess which Captain America shield is the right shield. <laughs> That's fun. Yeah, good intro book for everyone. Good job, Marvel. Way to take a stand against bullying. Hey, thanks a lot, everyone. We appreciate you watching. Welcome to uh, 2015. Mm -hmm. It's yeah. going to be a big year. We're going to have a lot of stuff coming your way. Oh, yeah, it is going to be a big year. Big year for comics especially. Yeah, later this month, the big one is the new Star Wars. Oh, oh yeah. man, that's, that's going to be a, sweet. Yeah, big book. Definitely a collector's item. Yeah. yeah. Phenomenal writers cool. and artists on both of those. Oh, yeah, yeah, on all those. Well, anyways, thanks a lot for watching. We appreciate it. Have a great week, y'all.